Uh, it feels great. Um, I didn't play last year, so it feels like it's been, you know, almost two years that I didn't play here, which is, um, you know, I always love coming here. It's such a special event uh, for any any tennis player and any tennis fan. And uh, being back here with uh, with an extra member of my team is really special. Well, uh, we started conversations really f with my team. You know, my uh, coach Michael um, asked me one morning. He's like, "Hey, I think." Um, you've been training really well, and I think you'll be ready to to go and um, play early. What do you think about you know starting Wimbledon and maybe a little bit earlier? And at first, I wasn't uh, really sure if I was ready mentally because it, you know I planned everything, you know tickets and and stuff, and how we're going to travel and all the arrangements um, starting in Stanford. But um, so I thought about it for about a week, I think maybe even two, and then I I felt like I was ready to to compete. Um, I was tired of practicing and just keep going through drills, so I I needed the competition. Well, she's definitely not a, uh, not an easy opponent, uh, especially in the first round. Uh, you know, I'm here um, unseated with with no really no ranking, so I don't uh, ex uh, I didn't really ex know who I'm gonna play. I don't I expect every round to be tough so um physical aspect i think i i improved the most um in in this uh break let's let's let, let's say that way i definitely feel a lot uh, fitter than i ever w uh than i ever were before and i want to continue to to go into that direction and um you know in tennis and in tournaments um you can feel great on the on the practice court but to be able to transfer that into the match, I think, is, is real art. And um, sometimes it takes time, sometimes it clicks right away, so you never know. But I think I'm on the right path to bringing all those um, components together and um, try to play better than I ever was before.